Isabel Roloff has only been a mother for two plus weeks now. Moreover, the former Little People Big World star has admitted to followers that giving birth to her son this month was a traumatic experience. And yet, Roloff just admitted something else. She's pretty much ready for a second child already. This past Friday, Isabel took some time to interact with her fans on her Instagram story page, responding at one point to a woman who said she was terrified of pregnancy. This person then asked Isabel for advice on the topic, and this is when Roloff gushed over the entire process. It's really a hard but also very magical experience, Isabel opened in reply. If you're terrified, ask yourself why. Write down all of the reasons. I was scared too. Scared of getting sick, all the changes. But now, Isabel continued, I miss it and I can't wait to do it again. It's a unique experience to each person who gets to walk through it. Only do it if your heart truly feels called to it. Isabel and her husband Jacob only just welcomed son Matteo on December 4th, so we somehow doubt they'll get busy on baby number two anytime soon. But it's impressive and interesting that Isabel sounds ready for another already, considering what she previously said about her labor and delivery. Tired and happy, wrote Isabel over a selfie a week ago, adding, A lot of you are asking if I had a C-section. No, but my birth plan completely flew out the window, it was almost comical. At least now I can kind of reflect on it with some humor. Continued Isabel shedding a bit of light on what transpired and how it impacted her newborn, who spent some time in the NICU. It was wild and traumatic, and maybe I'll share my birth story sometime. For now, I'm just glad I adapted and trusted the entire process. I would do it all again to get Matteo here safely. Now for lots of rest and post-party healing. Jacob and Isabel started dating in 2014 after a meeting in high school. The couple got engaged in 2018, got married in September 2019, and announced they were expecting their first child together in July 2021. We know Matteo isn't at work, and we also know we won't be getting a glimpse of the newborn anytime soon. We knew before we had him that we wanted to protect his privacy online, Isabel told followers a few days ago. How that looks was always going to change because you don't know until you're in it, how you're going to feel, what you're going to feel comfortable sharing when baby's really here. Ultimately, Jacob said from the beginning that we will share very little about our kids, and I agreed. So now we are navigating that daily, checking in with each other about comfortability and what we choose to share. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.